this was our first look at our future home. It was pretty bleak. It had been abandoned for about 10 years. It was an old farmstead. It had a hole in the floor where the sink was. The roof leaked. There were no doors on the back. The bathroom even had carpet. We had quite the project cut out for ourselves. But we knew with sweat equity, we could turn this into a dream house. During this time, the older girls shared a tent. Because they wanted space, our small camper was only 22 feet, and with the four of us, it was pretty tight. We made it work. It was just over a year that we lived in that, until we finished the house. We all worked together, but sometimes it was really hard to keep going. I tried to see beauty, not just the work. It really started to come together, and my vision, what I'd seen in my head, finally started becoming a reality. We were so close to being done, which was really good, because we had a surprise. After seven years of waiting, I was pregnant. We had two older girls, Emily, who was getting ready to go to college, and Navara, who was just starting high school. My husband and I had really wanted one last child, and it looked like we were going to get the house done just in time. Nine days before she was born, we moved into the house. And we were able to have her at home when we had wanted. Thanks so much for watching. If you could do something, it would help us so much. Simple as subscribe and like and comment. We would love to hear your comments. And one last note, despite all the work we've done on the house, I would say editing has been the most difficult thing I have ever done. What about you guys? All right, we'll see you next time.